Good day, my name is uh, Shol and I work for a company Micrographics. Uh, we can be found on the web at uh, www.mgfx.co.za. Alright, so the purpose of this video is to just uh, show uh, a new feature on uh, Revit 2021 and in particular the uh, new uh, categories that's been added to support the uh, bridge and infrastructure workflows. Right, um, as as mentioned, um, these categories uh, support the the, the new uh, or bridge workflow, um, and uh, in particular from uh, a, a product called InfraWorks, uh, where at, where you can design your uh, uh, or, uh, visualization of the bridge, and then you bring it into um, Revit uh, to uh, detail and design it further, and then. Um, um, document uh, as well. Alright, so to support that workflow, um, if I just, um, I've opened a, a simple drawing, I uh, just want to go to its uh, plan and then perhaps uh, just go to the, to show you the uh, 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 the model and annotation categories that's been added. So um, firstly, uh, there's also been, uh, they've added a, a, a filter list, so um, this is just to uh, to break up and to easily or more easily see um, all the infrastructure in this case uh, um, categories so once I've done that uh, these are now model categories and you can see um, they've added 26 uh, new uh, model categories under the, the InfraWorks uh, or infrastructure uh, uh, category filter um, you'll, uh, there's the bridge uh, information and uh, and there's some structural um, information here as well that they've uh, that they've added. All right, um, so um, very nice um, to support those workflows. Um, and then also, uh, if I go to the annotation area, um, you'll also see same same story with regards to the the filter list that they've added, uh, as well as um, they've added 20 new. Uh, ca categories. Now, the significance of this is that um, obviously it's uh, categories are hard coded, um, so a user can't add it, so it needs to come from uh, the developers. Yes, you can uh, add subcategories, um, but uh, main categories um, needs to be controlled um, uh, centrally. All right, um, the significance of it is that uh, it caters now for a larger number of users, um, including the bridge and the infrastructure users that. Um, that it supports. So um, Revit is growing its uh, user base, and uh, it's good news, obviously, for for uh, uh, that uh, that industry that is now being uh, catered for within um, uh, Revit. All right. Um, so it's a, a basically small, short uh, video, and um, thank you for for watching, um, and uh, hope that um, you learned something.